Antonio, hello, good evening. How are you? Doing better? Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. You doing better? Yes, teacher. I feel better. Thank you to us. That's nice. Can you That's hear me? Nice. Yes, I can. I can. That's excellent. And tell me, how was how was your day? Uh, just a little hard, teacher, but I'm here. I'm here. I'm okay. I I feel better today. No, that's important. Yes, I got I got sick since last Friday, teacher. Yeah, a lot. Yes. But good thing is that you are ready and you're feeling better. That's that's what matters. Yes, teacher. And you've been going to your job? Have you gone to work? Yes, I I went to the job. Ouch. That's more uncomfortable to, to have to go to work and feeling sick. That the problem is that that my my job is depending on me. I have a, I have a, another co-worker but uh, they they have the the out job in compromise. And also, my my job is difficult to do for a uh, another coworker. Okay, well, yeah, that's a problem when you're in a situation like that. That it depends on you. I mean, that's no option, right? You have to be. Yes, is is for that I I don't went to the the hospital or the or the empresarial, empresarial clinic because they they gave me a incapacidad or day off. Yeah, a leave of absence. Yes, but I I talked to with my my supervisor and I told him if you want I can go to the the clinic empresarial but but you know it's difficult for for the other worker. For me, no problem, I say. And he told me, no, no problem, I just uh, take medicine, uh, drink uh, pills, and all. But yesterday, I, I felt very bad, too. Yeah, I can imagine. But, but, Yes, yesterday was difficult all day for me, and also at night too. But I, I get better, teacher. I get better. Okay, hey, excellent. That's great. That's great. Yeah, because I mean, time to work and being sick is also, uncomfortable. Yeah, tell me. Yes. And also on, on Saturday, I went to work six, two, six. So it's been hard. But for I was, yes, I was working lonely at at my in my office. Oh, okay, alone, alone. Oh, I was alone in my alone. Yes. Okay. Well, it's nice to have you here, Mister. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, Carlos Antonio, hello. Hello, teacher, good evening. Good evening, how are you? I'm fine, thank you for asking me. How are you? Uh, same old story as usual, you know. Work, work, and more work. What can I tell you? You can um, tell me that you can change the world by teaching. Yeah, but... Uh, 
to be honest, uh, I enjoy my I enjoy my job. I mean, that's the first thing. And the other one is, you know, nowadays you gotta work a lot. I know. But I mean, could be worse. I can complain actually. I have a I have a, I work in something that I like and that's very important. I were doing something that I enjoy and and that that helps making the the, the, the activities like more um how do you know that you're doing the right things in your life? Because you enjoy what you do. I mean to be honest with you, yes, of course, I end up my day tired, but I mean, I never feel like saying like, oh, man, I don't, I don't want to work, go to work. I don't want to go teach. I mean, I feel cool. Yes, sometimes, of course, sometimes, sometimes I feel, yeah, sometimes I feel tired and that's normal, but it's not like, uh, it's not like I feel like, man, uh, I could be doing something else. No, it's like, uh, yeah, of course, I'm tired. I got a lot to do, but that's okay. I like it. It's fine. And what about you? How was everything for you today? It's kind of difficult, you know. Every day is a new challenge. Yeah, that's the way of life. And yeah. actually, I mean... There's not that much that we can do about it. That's how life works, you know? Yeah. Some days are some days are hard and some are harder. And some days are happy. Yeah. But there are not that many. But after all, we are breathing. <laughs> we're still breathing yeah we're kicking it I know it as I, and as I told you it will be worse it will be worse I mean the good thing is that we still got the, the strength to keep on going and yeah of course not all it's not always easy but I mean it's life right I would like to say a lot of things to you, but I don't know how to start. Sometimes I forgot the, the vocabulary. Don't worry. Don't worry. And I don't know That's how to normal. organize my, my, my top, you know. Yeah, don't worry. Don't worry. That's normal. It's a matter of time, right? Yeah. It's a matter of time and practice. Both things. Okay. Give me just a second. Okay, let's see. Uh, well, thank you, Carlos. Nice having you here. Okay, I'll be here. Francisco, welcome back. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. How are you, my friend? Nice. I I believe that I have a good night because my work was in satis satisfied. Uh, satisfied. Was a satisfied day. Uh, sorry. Satisfied. What? Satisfying. Satisfying. Okay, that's nice. It's yes. cool. Thank you, Orlando. It's cool when you got a satisfying day. Great. I mean, when you can end uh, up your day and saying like, yeah, it's okay. It was fine. That's nice. And tell me, what did you do today? What do you do? What? Um... 
my work is how can I say despachar producto hacia otros países oh really set up deliveries mm. in other nice. countries yeah wow yes a big responsibility yes the company and I and I am working now is a uh, is manufacturing us the postes de concreto para tendido eléctrico oh my it's international company well that's interesting actually that's yes, so interesting because it's complicated yeah because when you talk about that but it's product, not complete, uh, that is not difficult it's not impossible it's hard but not impossible yeah and i mean when you talk about deliveries i mean there's paperwork there's a process i mean it's complex and and those things i mean somebody can say you know it's just it's just post it right but i mean there's a well you got the certification first you have to take into consideration that you have to check out uh, paperwork about deliveries and actually it's a big responsibility right yes oh well, that's nice welcome to the class francisco nice having you here thank you but yesterday i can i can connect because it's my work and sometimes it's so hard and i don't have a, a little time yesterday i couldn't connect mm -hmm. yes and uh, don't worry but the good thing is that you're here now yes that's what uh, matters that's what matters okay welcome thank you oh, thanks to you hey magdaleno hello how are you hey teacher long time no see teacher. for yesterday yeah how's life treating you today um also <laughs> i i am not sure if i understood <clears throat> ¿Cómo le trata la vida en este día? Um, my life today was generous. Um, uh, today was a relaxed day. Okay, I... that's the answer. That's the answer because I'm asking you, how's life treating you today? ¿Cómo le ha tratado la vida este día? And you say, ah, oh, it was relaxing. It was okay. Mm, well, was relaxed. Oh, really? Okay. Not too much to do at work? Oh, your harder days are the weekend, right? Um, um actually no. Today, uh, every week, every Tuesday, I have uh, two meetings. Every Tuesday, a meeting from from nine o'clock uh to to uh the midday mid at the noon noon at noon yeah at noon uh, from 9 a.m at noon and the afternoon and no in the afternoon from uh, 2 p.m to uh, 4 p.m and okay, from, it's a routine for PM. Tuesday. It is a routine. Wow. Yes, because today it was um, um, delayed, del retrasado. ¿Cómo sería suspendido? Suspended. Suspended. Okay, it was suspended. It was relaxed for me. A uh, day off. A day of um, after. That's something that doesn't usually happen in your job. It's not usually. It yeah, is I not. Mean, it's, it's the first time in what? In Maybe like three one months? month. Yeah, like mm -hmm. in three months. That, no, in three months that I've been talking to you, 
I guess it's the first time that you're telling me about a day off. <laughs> yes, <laughs> the time is fly actually, because I, I don't, I, I no me di cuenta. I don't what I didn't realize. Oh, hold on, hold on. I Let me realize. text it for you. Let me text I it for you. Okay, yeah. I didn't realize of that. I didn't realize what what it was. No, <clears throat> I didn't realize what. Uh, what it have passed. That time has passed. Mm. Yes. Okay, okay. Uh, Magdaleno, somebody is asking me about what's your profession. My profession? Yeah, what do you do? What's your job? I'm a pastor. A pastor oh. uh, at the church. Ah, yeah, at church, because I was thinking about where's your flock? Well, actually, you got a flock. You know that word? Ah, flock. flock. Rebaño. Uh -huh. <laughs> I am a, bast uh, a Baptist pastor in a Baptist church. At a, at a Baptist church. At a Baptist church, yes. I am a, ba a Baptist. Okay, that's, that's his job. Mm -hmm. Well, one of the jobs, because yeah, sometimes, I mean, in your job, sometimes you perform as a teacher, as a counselor, right? Um, oh, so, so sorry, teacher. I, I sometimes love you work, in the world. Sometimes you work as a teacher, and also sometimes part of your obligation is working as a counselor. I don't know what is a counselor. No, counselor. Yeah, yeah like sometimes. Mm -hmm. Sometimes yeah. I have to be a teacher. I have to, to, to teach sometimes Bible, sometimes uh, leadership classes, or, and other times I, I, had, I had teached. No, I tough, tough is, is enseñar en inglés tough or tough? I have taught, tough is the past. ¿Cómo? If you say tough, you are talking in past. Yeah, in past, tough. I was, I have, uh, in other time, I, I had taught um, uh, children, cl um, children classes. Like um, uh, dominical school or biblic school, yeah, Bible with with, ch with children, mm -hmm. with the little That's boys. And the other time, I remember mm -hmm. sometimes I was uh, I was teach I no sometimes I remember that I had mm -hmm. I had taught um, uh, a sport. And um, sports uh, like um, bas be uh, basketball, baseball, and football, soccer. And I, actually, I don't know what, how I can play uh, as a professional player, but it's only for only a game. Yeah, only just for, for fun. Just for just fun. fun. Just yeah, for... yeah, in your case, you have to play different roles. Magdaleno, always a pleasure talking to you. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. You're great. Man. Uh, Thank you. Thanks to you, guys. Let's see who else is around. I still got time, but let me get the attendance. So I don't forget because Orlando is telling me, teacher, remember the attendance. I am obedient. Uh, let's see. Carlos Antonio Terrano Arias. Present, teacher. Progress, progress, progress. Carlos Elivaldo Abrego Marmol. Present. 
Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo, no here. Gabriel Beltrán Perez. Present teacher. Gustavo Javier Ramirez Carranza, no here. And Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Marina. Ivan Petrovich Guzman Aquino. Holman Saúl Girón Sánchez. Present. Thank you, mister. And Josué Rodrigo Ortiz Monterrosa. Hi, teacher. Hi. Juan Francisco Echala Montano. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Carla Lizette García Lemos. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present, teacher. Luis Mario Criollo Guerrero. Present, teacher. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Nelson Present Antonio teacher. Rodas Rosales. Thank you, Magdalena. Present teacher. Thank you, Nelson. Orlando Francisco Núñez. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Present teacher. Rosalina Alvarado. Vilma Yesenia Alvarenga. Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present teacher. Thank you, Wilfredo. Siamar Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Oh my gosh, you are the only lady, Siamar. Ivania Shamile Dominguez Hernández. And Marlon Jonathan Gutierrez Quirón. Present teacher. Hey Marlon, how are you? Hi teacher. How was everything? How was your day? I tired. Uh, really? For, yes, for this day I was working a lot in my work. Oh, really? A lot of work to do today? Yes. Because oh. the machine yes. that we are using uh, have many problems because they are brown from Honduras. And we have to set them up again. Oh. Yeah, working with new equipment is sometimes troublesome, right? Yes. But let's hope tomorrow is a better day. That's the idea. Probably. Yeah, let's hope everything turns out okay for you. Let's see. And um, well, well, it's around. Uh, Josué Rodrigo, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Thank you. Okay, how's everything for you? How was your day? Today, it was a great day because I went to the hospital um, to make a uh, uh, I chequeo, check my teeth i oh really checked yes, i checked i checked my teeth um after that i went to the i went to the i went to my work okay i hate going to the dentist it's necessary I, yeah but still i hate it yeah. I mean, it's it's not something I enjoy. I'll be honest with you. It's not something I enjoy. I mean, for me, going to the dentist is... Uh, it's a... <laughs> it's a oh, it's I got a new word for you. This is a new word, a new word for you guys. Ordeal. Ordeal. Yep. The, 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 the word, the uh, I mean, when you say an ordeal, ordeal, it's like a, una prueba rigurosa, uh, something that, that you don't like, it's hard for you, but I mean, you have to do it. Like, uh, you know, Magdaleno, 
sometimes when he's teaching Bible, he's teaching about the ordeal, uh, our Lord Jesus, how to undergo when he was suffering for us, right? The ordeal. It was a very hard situation. It was a very difficult situation that he had to face. You got it? Do you understand, Jose? Do you understand? Yes, 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 yes. I understand. Like okay. a mask, too. Yes. It's something very hard. A situation that is pretty hard. Okay. Okay, well. Yeah. Well, mister, nice having you here. Welcome. Un gusto tenerlo por acá. Bienvenido. Okay, thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Okay, guys. Well, today we're going to go straight to the point. First, uh, we are going to work a little bit of a conversation, talk, talking a little bit about the vocabulary from the manual. Uh, conversations but before we move on let's take advantage of the fact that uh, we got a uh, second that we got some of your classmates here that have just arrived and Rosalina Alvarado good evening teacher just say present Rosalina just present <laughs> I, I, I understand. Yeah, yeah. But don't worry, don't my worry. face is very ugly then. <laughs> Excuse Man, me. Don't worry, Rosalina. I avoid looking at the at the mirror, so it can never be worse <laughs> than this one. <laughs> okay. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> okay. Ivan Petrovich Kuzman Aquino. Present. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you. Okay, guys, let's see. And there's also Miss, 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 Miss. Carla Lizeth Garcia Lemos. Present. Thank you. Okay, guys, now. Uh, well, you know that uh, when when you go to a place for eating something, when you go to a restaurant, uh, when you order something from a restaurant, from a takeout or delivery or in the restaurant, I mean, there are always procedures. But the question we are going to discuss is this, are procedures in a restaurant important? Do you consider that uh, procedures special procedures designed uh, in a restaurant are important and if you consider that it's so tell me why please okay that's the question that's the first question that we are going to discuss how working in groups okay you are going to have a conversation and you're going to talk to your classmates you're going to discuss and i will have one member per group okay and you don't know who am I going to ask. So everybody needs to be prepared. Groups are open, you got four minutes to discuss. Are procedures in a restaurant important? Yes or no? Why? Okay, I need an explanation. Why do you think they are important? ¿Y por qué? 
I pro are procedures in a restaurant important? Son importantes yep. los procedimientos. Why? Of course, yes. Because if you go, for example, to McDonald's, for example, are you expecting for a clean uh, place? Uh, for a clean food that that works. Okay. For a clean food, uh, I don't know how to say presentable. Acceptable with good presentation. <laughs> with a person, personal with a good presentation. <clears throat> I think is all uh, all the how do you say the cleaning and the good presentation in a restaurant are um uh, indispensable necessary or necessary and okay. i don't think the people want to eat something in a ugly place Okay. I don't know how to say. No, that's okay. That's okay. Well done. For example, my wife went, well, she lived in Mexico for an and a half year. So, and she said to me that some places there are cooking tacos <laughs> with uh, dog meat and the cheaper tacos are the worst because um, if you are not prepared for that kind of tacos, uh, it's a secure di diarrhea that you will have. Already, because the people, because some places the people doesn't don't have sorry don't have the the cleaning procedures to make a good food. And that's why the people, some, some uh, are sick, sick? Yeah, get sick. Get sick. Thank okay. You. Keep on discussing with Wilfredo and Oscar. I need to go check the, the rest of the groups, okay? Okay. And a good presentation for the employees. In service, on time. Yeah. And uh -huh. in the personal. Servir la comida a tiempo. A tiempo. Mm Okay, guys, 60 seconds.
Okay, let's see. Everybody's coming in a few seconds. Okay, let's see, first group. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Jose Rodrigo, tell me, are procedures important and in, 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 in an import in a restaurant? Let's go. Not here yet. Let's see. Nope. Then this group yeah. was. Oh we... yeah. There. Tell me. Tell me. Are they important? We talked with the groups. It's important to good good presentations. Okay. The employed. The employed. The the the. The food is on time. Okay. Um, music, uh, good music. The, um, the different way to pay cash or cars. Okay, perfect, thank you. Uh, Antonio, what about you and your group? Tell me, what did you discuss? Okay, teacher, I was talking with uh, Gabriel and Rosalina. Yeah. And, right. and we are agree about the, every procedure in a restaurant are very important. It's because the, the, the independent on, on this, the the good the good manage or administration of the restaurant it depend of the clients it depend of the waiters it depend of the the chicken the procedure in every in every place in the restaurant is very important hey thank you very the, much the, yes yes Yes. Okay, and that actually takes me to the second question, guys. I know that uh, all of you prepare, but don't worry. We are going to use what you have done. It will be a time, okay? Now, because uh, the second question we got is related to the same topic. Is a customer's experience in a restaurant affected by procedure? That's actually what uh, Antonio was getting into. So right now, is a customer experience in a restaurant affected by procedures? How, how do you feel in a restaurant? It's affected by the procedures the people, the workers in the restaurant follow? Three minutes, this is shorter because it's just a little bit of a explanation, something that you're going to add to the first activity, okay? Just three minutes. Hey. What do you think, my friend? Yes. Mm -hmm. 
Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. What happened, Carla? You couldn't get into the group? Uh, Luis Abrego y... No me acuerdo el otro, ¿cómo se llama? Yeah, but I wonder why you didn't get into the group. No sé por qué no okay. se logró ir. Okay. But I'm going to bring them back in one minute, okay? Okay. Is it uh, the, of the customer yeah. is important because uh, we work for the client. In your opinion, I'm agree with you. Where in every business, the client are the center. Uh, in other words, uh, uh, the client are the main part in all businesses. Because if you don't have clients, you don't have a business. In this case. The procedure, if you don't have a good procedure in, in your restaurant, the experience of the clients, it, it will be, will, it's, it won't be a good experience. And then the client don't return again to the restaurant. The right. client will not return, will not will not no it's want no i want yeah you can say want okay. you can say want okay will not return uh, this is the situation is my opinion what you Let's bring everybody. 60 seconds, guys, 60 seconds. Okay, let's see. Uh, um, who's gonna be? Who's gonna be? Who's gonna be? Well, Orlando, tell me. Do you yes, think yes, the yes. do you think the experience the, of the customer is affected by the procedures of the restaurant? Uh, we discussed with my partner 
that definitely yes because if you are if you are looking for some good food uh you will not go um a place that has a bad reputation uh, as i told you before about the tacos in mexico for example uh, and here we have the, the opportunity to have something that is uh, parecido. I don't know how to say Similar. that. Similar, thank you. Uh, with the choris. But the choris has a good... Um, higiene. Higiene. Uh, hygiene. 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 They, they has a good, a good hygiene, uh, but I said to my companions, to my partner, sorry, um, in my case, if it's not my food, it doesn't matter for me, but if before to purchase, I will looking for a good place. I don't know if it's difficult to explain this this question, but I I think if you are looking for a good place, um, you can look for some reviews in Facebook or Instagram about the place. Okay, that would be more easy for you if you have if you want to. That will be easier. Good experience. That will be easier. Okay. Thank you. Ivan, tell me, what did you discuss with your classmate? Um, we we talk my 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 partners. Um, the customer service is is most important. Uh, and I said I feel I feel a customer. I feel in customers. Uh, um, Este, cómodo, cómo, how do you say cómodo? Comfortable. Uh, excuse me. Comfortable. Comfortable. Um, happy in the restaurants. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. I mean, that's your point of view. That's excellent. Let's see. Um, Marlon, what do you think about it? What do you think of this topic we are discussing? Uh, the opinion of the customer is very important because the, they define the wrong of the restaurant. If the client does not like the attention of the restaurant, it is possible that, that he will not visit it again. Yeah, and you lose a customer, that's never good, right? Yes. Yeah, so you're quite right in that. Thank you. Okay, guys, let's see. Next activity. Okay. Now, you have to number the steps a waiter follows to take and serve an order. We got here, take customer's order, confirm the order, see the customer, serve the food, greet the customer, handle the food correctly. You are going to number the steps, okay? You're going to go back again to working groups, but right now you are going to switch platform, okay? Just one second. Okay, groups are created. Three minutes. Okay. 
let's see, we are sending the image. Okay, so everybody's got it. One is read the customer. You see? No, we I don't see who? where. I, excuse where me. Where is the picture? Where is the picture? Uh, isn't the page number seventeen? Is it number two? Mm -hmm. The exercise number two. I don't know. It's put in the WhatsApp. You don't have mm -hmm. a, that material. No, I don't have it. <clears throat> okay, look at. Is in the WhatsApp. You check in your yes. phone in the WhatsApp yes. to say the, ta the ta table. Oh, in the you chat, it? it's not yes, in the platform. Huh? In the platform, no, it's a chat. Yeah, in the chat. Yes, I found it. Okay. The the exercise is uh, put in order the number to the activities. You see? Number take customer orders. Greet the customer, I think, is the number one. Because when Great you customer. come to the restaurant, the people uh, te saluda, no? greeting the customer. Greet the customer, yes. Yeah, greet. number one. Greet, greet. Greet. Uh -huh. Greet. See, okay. greet, no, greet. Greet. Uh -huh. <coughs> the second one. Oh my gosh, for Salina. No, I, I, I force for for my my friends, I, but please don't don't put me talking on the group. <laughs> oh yeah, you have to. Okay, the second one, um, Francisco. Uh, I. After the take a customer orders on confirm the order i think see the customer when you come to the restaurant somebody greet um uh, greeting for you and next greets next you step, greets you next step you sit on the waiter say you no know? what is it what is the meaning sit sit, sit. sit. i am sitting down sit. oh sit. take a seat yeah, take a seat. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sit sure. Okay, okay, okay. You know okay. the customer? Yes. Yeah? Yes, you're right. Okay. <laughs> Number three, after after you sit on the restaurant, where's the next step? <laughs> uh, take a customer in order. <clears throat> uh-huh. Yeah. No. One, two, three. Yes, yes. Uh huh. And the and the other one. Confirm the order. Uh huh. And the last this the other takes. Uh huh. Uh, confirm the order. Sure. The the waiter. Is that it? what you thinking in in the in this case? Hello. It depends if I'm hungry. Um, feel angry. But if not hungry, I'm, I'm comprehension. The, the way. I am understanding. I'm understanding the in practice the empathy. 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 I think. And you? Oh. It's empathy. Magdaleno doesn't know what's empathy. He says, what's that? So sorry. I, I get hungry, angry with that. I get yeah, angry. He, oh. he wants full, period. Only image. 
you you if you could imagine that um i am so hungry i am very hungry and the waiter said uh, is uh, here is your for example order uh, yes uh, here's your your roast beef no man i order a ceviche i don't like the the, the beef uh, so you can imagine that well, actually, what I can imagine is you complaining. You are like, oh, I want my roast beef. <laughs> With a lot of a smug, uh, get out from my ears. Coming out, coming out. Coming out? Yeah, a lot of smug coming out of my ears. Okay, a lot of a smug coming out from my ears. And Xiomara, you can imagine... Oh, Carla, you can imagine, they both so angry, complaining with the, with the, with the manager from the restaurant, with, with, uh, sen, uh, yeah, I can totally Ghana. picture Carla complaining. Yes. <laughs> Carla is not here, maybe. I don't know. Maybe we are alone. Okay. Is that is only the, the exercise number two, teacher? Yep, we we'll go back right now. Okay. Okay. I remember. Uh, Someday, uh, a woman, a woman, Okay, Luis Abrego. Okay, teacher. Let's do the exercise. Okay, what's the first step, my friend? Uh, greet the customer. Uh -huh. Next one. Send the customer. Okay, let's see. First, you said greet the customers. That's number one. Number two? Yeah, I'm the customer. Feed the customer. Feed, feed the customer. Okay, now that. Number two. Number three, mister? Take customer order. Take the customer's order. Okay. Number three, number four. Confirm the order. Confirm the order. Okay, confirm the order. Number five. Handle the food for the Okay, handle, handle. 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 Handle the food correctly. And number six, of course. Serve the food. Serve the food. So we got greet the customer, take the customer, take customer order, confirm the order, handle the food correctly, and serve the food. Questions? No. 
Okay, perfect. Okay, guys, now we got exercise three and four. In exercise three, you need to look for the vocabulary. In exercise four, we got which of the following are the most common issues with parents you have experienced in a restaurant? Do you think established in a procedure to help reduce those issues? Why? Okay, so you're going to do this and this. For this, we are going to have 10 minutes. But before we go there, let me get the second attendance, okay? If you are so very kind. Okay, Carlos Antonio Serrano Arias. Present teacher. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Marma. Present teacher. Ewen Alberto Rodriguez Lobo, Gabriel Beltran Perez. Present teacher. Gustavo Javier Ramírez Carranza. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina. <coughs> Ivan Petrovic Guzmán Aquino. Lessons. Holman Saúl Girón Sánchez. Present. Eh, Josué Rodrigo Ortiz Monterrosa. Hi, teacher. Thank you. Juan Francisco Ayala Montano. Present. Carla Lisbeth García Lemos. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present, teacher. Luis Mario Criollo Guerrero. Present teacher. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present Nelson, teacher. Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present. Orlando Francisco Núñez. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Thank you, Oscar Armando. Thank you, Rosalina. Vilma Yesenia Alvarenga. Wilfredo Areval Ortiz. Present teacher. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Ivania Yamile Domínguez Hernández. En Marlon Jonathan Gutiérrez Girón. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Well, let's see. I'm going to send you back to the groups. And remember, you will have 10 minutes for this exercise. Now, in this exercise, you are going to change. The groups are going to be slightly, slightly bigger. Okay. Just let me fix a little something here with the groups. Okay, groups are created. 10 minutes for the exercise. I'm going to send it to you right now, the screenshot, okay?
see, let's see, let's see, let's see. My dear Ingrid, I'm gonna send you to a group. Hello, teacher. <laughs> okay, you go to group number five. Okay, guys, the words, I do not want them in Spanish. I want the explanation in English, okay? I want the explanation in English. You will explain to the teacher about the words, but for example, uh, what confirm means. Uh -huh. You can say confirm means that uh, the, let me see, the, no, what is the word, the waiter, uh, take your order and ask you if the food you are ordering is correct. Okay. And you say, yes, that's my order. You are confirmed to the waiter about your food. Okay. Uh, the image mm -hmm. is, for example, the lexon number three Same and name. lexon Image. Payment. I don't understand. Okay. Again. Okay. Uh, Please. Are you seeing? Are you seeing the image? Uh huh. That the teacher sent to the group. Yes. It but, was a group. Okay. Yes, but the in the, the, in the number chat? three we have some uh -huh. words. Mm hmm. Ah, okay, I and understand. And we have yeah. words. I, I saw the, I the, saw the image. Payment. I mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Okay, so payment, what is the meaning of for that with your words? What is the idea of the payment word? Wait, just a second, just a second, please. The, the payment, for me, payment and is when you're, you're, you're paid for a different products uh, or different method the pay. Hello. Yes, we hear you. Yes, okay. For me, payment is when different product and your boot, the work, uh, your boot default. What is your payment? I don't know, sorry, but uh, for it, what is your payment for this clothes? Hi, teacher. Yeah, that's that's payment. You're listening. You're listening. 
Yes, what you can do also but is this, this. You, can, you can write the word right payment in your correct. browser. Yes, something else that you can do is write in your, write in your browser payment and write next to it uh, definition. Algo que pueden hacer también es para buscar la definición, porque es lo que les estoy pidiendo, es pongan la palabra en el browser, escriba payment y en la pared que vale definition. Ah, okay. Okay, thank you, teacher. I mean, that could help. Wilfredo, hello. Hi, teacher, hello. Come on, Wilfredo, you are very quiet. You are very quiet today. Um, Muy callado, lo siento hoy. Uh, We're going to have conversation, Wilfredo. Estoy, como le digo, estoy perdido, teacher. Ok, el primer ejercicio nos pide a nosotros de que busquemos la definición. Entonces usted lo que va a hacer nada más es, puede buscarlo en internet, buscar qué significa cada palabra, pero en inglés, como la explicación, pero en inglés. Okay. In the second exercise, en el segundo ejercicio, you got which of the following are the most common issues with service you have experienced. ¿Cuál de los siguientes son los problemas más comunes que has tenido con el servicio in a restaurant? Y ahí la pared, and the waiter gets you food you did not ask for, le llevan comida que usted no ha pedido, the food takes too long to be served after ordering it, se tarda mucho en llevarla, the waiter is not polite, el mesero no es amable, ¿ok? Luego lo dice. Do you think establishing a procedure could help reduce those issues? ¿Usted cree que establecer un proceso podría ayudar a resolver esos problemas? Y luego usted explica el por qué. ¿Por qué sí? ¿Por qué no? Great. Only one uh, second question. Ok. Eso es lo que van a hacer. Contestarles. Ok. Great. And there's also Xiomara. Xiomara, hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, Xiomara, you are here, you are here. You can help each other. Pueden ayudarte. And exercise number three. Yep, three and four. Uh, the first hundred. It's a situation or problem. Uh -huh. Confirm to give approval. Payment. The handle, app. handle, handle, handle. Handle is manejar algo o lidiar con algo. Okay. Usually the word handle refers, normalmente se refiere a un agarradero, but when you handle a situation, it's different, right? Teacher, I have a, a dude, dude. A doubt. A doubt. It's similar uh, as Xiomara. When you use this word in one, in one, in different situation, but where? Okay. When? Look, uh, uh -huh. let's see. There's, ah, Orlando. Hello, Orlando. Hi, teacher. Sorry, I have some issues with the connection. No problem, no problem. You know, Orlando, here your classmate Ingrid, man, she's very delicate. She's a problem. <laughs> what? So I have, I, listen, I have to deal with her very carefully. I have to handle her very carefully. Mm -hmm. uh, got, it? got it, Ingrid? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, now. Imagine, Ingrid, we are uh, we are in the classroom. I'm in the classroom. Mm -hmm. and, and you are constl constantly talking on your phone. And I tell you, Ingrid, please handle that cell phone to me. Demelo. Right here in the hand. Handle. También significa eso. Dar en la mano. Okay, teacher. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. 
Yes, he is. Um, Luis. Luigi. Luis, are you there? Hello. No. I don't no, know, but I'm, but I'm here. I lost. I lost him. <laughs> okay. And then the another question is, what do you think establishing a procedure could help procedure. reduce? Procedure. 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 You are Pro so no, low. Es que, es que no escuché cuando la dijo, sorry. <laughs> no, 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 Happy. <laughs> you really got me with that. I mean, I was so concentrated and you go like, okay. And I was like, what? <coughs> Procedure. And, yeah, we Carlos, Carlos was like this, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> he, he helped me. Reduce those uses. Okay. Issues. What do you think, Carlos? Is the food take too long to be served? What do you recommend to the restaurant for the change that situation? Maybe we can. Excuse me. More personal. More personal could be a suggestion, yeah, right? Maybe. Más personal. Mm -hmm. Minutes, guys. Hello, guys. Everybody very quiet here. Allman, Carlos Elivaldo. Carlos Elivaldo, hello. How are you? Hi, teacher. Hi, Allman. Este, ahorita, en eso estoy ahí tratando. Magdalena, Magdalena is in a meeting, right? Sí, es, es, él dijo que no iba a poder participar por el momento. Este... Ahorita estaba viendo la primera. Oh, and, and Oscar is having problems with connection. Carlos Elivaldo, hello. Hello, hello. How are you? Ok, con el vocabulario, el primer ejercicio era simple. Ustedes lo que hacen es, váyanse a, pueden hacerlo en el browser, en el buscador. No quiero una traducción de la palabra, sino que, ¿cómo se usa? Cuéntenme cómo se usa, ok. Entonces usted puede hacer una gestión, puede buscar la palabra de esta manera. You can write it, type the word, puede escribir la palabra, A, N, L, the word, y al final de la palabra, escríbanle, no meaning, meaning es significado, sino que definition. La definición. E internet les va a decir cuál es, el, cuál es la definición de la palabra, cómo se usa. ¿Ok? Okay. Don't worry. With a couple that you do, it's okay. 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 Teacher, este, los significados, bueno, las definiciones son las que nos van a servir para complementar la cuatro. ¿verdad? No, no. En exercise four is different. What you got is this. Eh, 
usted tiene ahí un estado de situaciones, sí. problemas, con el servicio que pueden habernos pasado en un restaurante. Y le pregunta, ¿cuáles de ellas le han pasado a usted? Which of the following are the most common issues with service you have experienced in a restaurant? Usted marca ahí, ¿cuáles le han pasado? Do you think establishing a procedure will help reduce those issues? ¿Cree usted que establecer un procedimiento podría ayudar a reducir estos problemas? Y le gusta contestar, why? Yes or no? Sí o no? ¿Por qué? Ah, sí, eso estaba viendo. Nada más yo me confundí y pensaba que con los con los significados, las definiciones no iba a servir para contestar, pero ajá. sí, ahora entendí mejor. Ok, perfecto. Hello, guys. Finish with the exercise? Hi, teacher. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if it's true, Carla. Hello, Carla. Tell me, what's the definition of handle? Hello, teacher. What is uh, the handle? Handle. Handle. So, ¿Sí, ¿cuál es la definición de la palabra handle? Uh, manipulated with the okay. hands. Okay, to manipulate with the hands. Yeah, that's true. Also, también, it's used like, uh, I mean, se usa like this, look. Like, I'm talking to Luis Mario. I'm like, hi, Luis Mario, how are you? And Luis Mario tells me, oh, everything's fine. What about you? Yo le digo, oh, you know, I've been, I have this student, Carla. Carla is a problem. <laughs> And I have to handle her very carefully. Tengo que lidiar con ella. That's also an application of that word. También es que puede usar. Okay. Okay, we are going back to the main room right now, okay? This is the general group, right? Yes. Yes, it is, my friend. Yes, it is. Okay, let's see. What is to handle? Luis Mario, where are you? I am here, teacher. Okay, what is to handle? Okay, is the action where well, one of the meaning is uh, when you manipulate something with your hands. Okay, give me one example. For example, when you put um uh, a glass of water in in the table for example okay 
actually uh, um it's like this to look like uh, I will handle you a glass of water. Le voy a dar en sus manos. Okay. 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 When also you help you... someone yeah. with with something, right? Yep. Thank okay. you very much. Okay. Just one second. Okay. Now, next word, next word, next word. Rosalina, confirm, please. <coughs> okay, confirm. It's like a accept of the order or checking the order to the customer, with the customer. Okay. Accepting the order or checking <coughs> if the order is correct. I'm sorry for asking you. Yeah, no problem. So okay. Sorry, sorry. Okay, let's see. And Carlos Antonio. Yes, teacher. You got payment. Payment is the different ways to pay a, a check. You can pay by cash, you can pay by, by Bitcoin or by credit or debit card. That's okay. a payment. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Ivan. Okay. Okay, uh, great. Greeting, greeting, greeting. Greeting, okay. Uh, it's the way uh, the waitress, uh, uh, the waitress, uh, great, great, uh, the customers. He, he is, he, I, I wait. Um, is the, is the, la manera is the way a uh, communicators. Um, no. so yeah, well, like <laughs> it's okay. It's when you receive a person, right? Okay. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see, and then we got notify. What is to notify, uh, uh, Francisco Ayala? What is to notify? Francisco, I'm sorry, your microphone. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, notify is when you notify to the customer service that you order is correct. Okay, perfect, thank you. Now, okay. there appear a lot of problems or situations that are common on a, in a restaurant or getting service. I mean, they happen sometimes, not all the time, of course. Uh, do they, what, what are the most common that have happened to you, uh, Ingrid? English is here. Mm -hmm. well, she was a good she has some issue with the house yeah. keys. With the what? With the house keys. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, she lose his keys. Oh my gosh, she lost the key, her key. Yeah. <laughs> And she doesn't remember. She's down. She doesn't remember. She doesn't remember. Oh my gosh, that's a big problem. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, you can use it that way, Carlos Antonio, that's okay. Okay, let's see, well, mm -hmm. Wilfredo, tell me one problem that you have had on a restaurant. Dígame, la que están ahí, ¿cuál le ha pasado en un restaurante? Of the list that you got, of the issues. Okay, Wilfredo, we got this one's here, look. We got the waiter gets you food you did not ask for, the food takes too long. Which one, which of these has happened to you? What number, number one, teacher. The waiter. Really, waiter please. The waiter yes, gets you food you did not ask for. Oh, really? Yes. Okay, and what do you do? Gas is tennis as a question. Passing. <laughs> Be patient. Okay, well, that's a good attitude. That's a very good attitude. Be patient. Okay, now what about what about you, Antonio? Nelson Antonio, what what of these situations have happened to you? What of these issues have you have to encounter or face in the restaurant? In my case, is number two. The food takes too long to be served after ordering. Okay, and what do you do when you are faced with those situations? What's your attitude? I don't know, teacher, because I I don't have passion. Is the is the reason maybe this is the reason I don't I don't like visit the restaurant because I am a little passion. Okay, you know, to be patient is not one of your yes, sir. of your strong points. Okay, yeah, I can understand that. Yes, when I when I am are lonely, maybe I I leave the the place. But if if I I go to the maybe with my family or another relative. Uh, what can we do? Just waiting, waiting, or or the the almost time I I stand up and I I walk around the place. Oh really? So you are really, really. Uh, I mean, you are not a really patient person. Yes, teacher. Okay, well, yeah, that happens. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. You know, I'm I'm the total opposite. I can wait. I am very patient with those situations, but I mean everybody is different. Okay, yeah, thank you. Sure. Let's see. Uh, 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 Holman, what about you? Tell me. Which of the following are the most common issues with service you have experienced in a restaurant? Uh, well, uh, And uh, the when the uh, number four, when the number dish, four, uh -huh, uh -huh. the dish you want to order is not available, but it appears listed in the menu. Oh, it appears listed in the menu. Okay, and tell me, how do you think that problem could be solved from the restaurant? Uh, well, I think is. Uh, a little bit uh, uh, difficult to 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 resolve Solve the problem. Okay. Because uh, some and uh, some some <clears throat> something uh, there is and something uh, mm. there isn't. So. Is it's, it's bad for me when I want uh, uh, something and it's not there. Uh huh. In the specific, but there isn't. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Now, guys. Uh, okay. 
let's see, we are going to do another type of exercise right now. Okay. We still got a few minutes. And we are going to talk about stress. Okay. Some of you have already answered these questions, but I want to hear and I want to see you discussing this question. Okay, guys? And it's very simple. You're going to tell your classmates working in groups. You're going to answer one little question, but now the activity, okay? Do you remember well for the ones who have been with me before? Uh, let's see. Give me just a second. Okay. Okay, in, the question is, how does stress affect you? Okay, in group number one, the person in charge of asking the question is Rosalina. You, you will just ask the question, okay, Rosalina? In group number two, the person in charge of asking the question is Ivan. Ivan, you will moderate the group. In group okay. number three, it's going to be Carla Lister. And in group number four, the one in charge of moderating the group and asking the question and if necessary, doing follow-up questions is Luis Mario Criollo, okay? Okay, guys, you got eight minutes for the activity. Remember, it's a discussion when somebody is asking, the person in charge is asking the question and if necessary, do follow-up. Yes. Okay? Eight minutes. Eight minutes, guys, eight minutes. Okay, the question is, how does stress affect you, right? Yes, it's correct. Okay, I first, I fear I started with another question. Uh, where do you work? Yes, yes. Excuse Hello. me. Yes. Hello, teacher. Excuse me. Could you repeat what is the talking about, please? <laughs> You're going to ask your classmate how that stress affects you. Just that. How does stress affect you? ¿Cómo le, cómo le afecta el stress? And your classmates yeah. are going to explain. Okay. Okay. In okay, your case, you. Rosalina, you just ask the question because of your throw. Okay. Yeah. Thank do, you. Are you able to do the exercise? If not, I find someone else. Always understand. Gente que puede desarrollar el ejercicio, si no le pongo ahí. No, 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 it's okay, it's okay. I, I help, I collaborate. Wilfredo, you understand the question? ¿Cómo te afecta el estrés? Yeah, el estrés. Oh, okay, you try, you try to explain. How, how how do you feel when you, you have a stress? Okay. Very angry, he says. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> yeah, but there are the reactions are different. Like uh, some people get angry, some people get like tense, some mm -hmm. people get like uh, uh, anxious. Uh -huh. Okay. In my case, is similar to Carlos because uh, for me, sometimes in the in the restaurant, uh, they the waiter takes the order, and after that they say, "Okay, you can wait ten minutes or fifteen minutes." 
And so that you can say, oh, okay, everything is okay. But uh, pass <laughs> the minimum, with the minimum, and your eat or your food, no, don't receive, don't wait, don't see, don't look, I don't know. Maybe you <laughs> see you uh, looking for the waiter and don't look. And in, in your case, Antonio, raise your hand, raise your hand, nobody. Yes, man. <laughs> yes. Man. Uh, yes. Uh, the last one, my, I remember my, my, was, my wife told me, hey, hey, you relax. <laughs> It is, it's down. <laughs> yes. Hey, I was saying, let's go, let's go, let's go. It is. <laughs> yes, I I am a little passionate about that. Yes. yes. This is my case. No, it's normal. It's normal uh, affect. Did you? <laughs> yes. Yes, affect. Only that name for me. Okay. Remember that the question is in general. Okay, the camera will affect the stress in any situation. Oh, okay. 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 In real. Hello. Hello, teacher. Sorry. Okay. My... Where are your keys? Where were your keys? Not the I don't know, teacher. I, 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 I don't found. I, I don't didn't find. find. I didn't I find. Didn't, I didn't find. I called the how do how do you say cerrajería? Really, the locksmith. Yes, but I don't know. <laughs> I remember in the morning I put a llave keys in the door, but I don't remember. <laughs> I didn't find found the keys. <laughs> okay, but you didn't leave it on the door. Sorry, I no don't. Dejo en la puerta. No. Espero que no. <laughs> you're gonna find everything empty. Yes. But you're but you're not alone. Uh, no. Okay, that's I mean yes, yes, yes. Yeah, that's that's something very important for you not to be alone because I mean yes, teacher. See, sí, yes, thank you. I I say the the people, uh, I will 20 minutes approximately, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, but I mean, if you're waiting and there's somebody with you, that's that's better. Yes, I is very near the, my house. Is, it's, it's okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay, okay, let me send you to a group. Okay.
Okay, let's bring everybody back in time. Okay, let let be. We're just waiting for everybody to come back in a few seconds. Let's see, Gabriel, Gabriel. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Gabriel, how does stress affect you? Como me lo afecta el stress? Uh, it just give me back pain. <laughs> oh, really? Yes. Oh, you get stress, uh, you get a, a backache. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. That's quite common, actually. Thank you, Gabriel. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Carlos Elivaldo, what about you? How do you feel that stress affects you? Does it affect you in any way? Al estar de work. Al empezar uh -huh. a trabajar. Okay, and what does it produce on you? ¿Qué le produce? Um, Maybe, what do you say, inicio or start? Yeah. Start in the, in the, the half, in the, half in the, to levantarse temprano. Okay. Yeah, that's stressful. And that it produce something on you? It le produce algo like, uh, like you get anxious, como ansioso, or, or, Tenso. Uh, What's uh, the effect? Tenso. Tenso. Okay. Interesting. Let's see. Ingrid. Hello, Ingrid. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Ingrid, what does losing your kid, I mean, stress produce on you? What's the effect? What is the effect? Uh... I uh, the the effect is I I lost my keys. <laughs> okay, and tell uh, me, do you get like very stressed, like uh, angry or something? Yes. What's the common reaction you get when you whenever you get stressed? Uh, um there um for example i am you say very hungry and and very how do you say desesperado desperate desperate okay. i don't hungry I don't, hungry is that you want food you mean angry angry teacher sorry angry yes okay. <laughs> angry and desperate yes Okay, break a window. Yes. Okay, well, thank you, Ingrid. Thank Let's you, teacher. I, Ivan. I, I opened yes. the door, teacher. <laughs> you got it? Yes. Did the locksmith help? Llegó a locksmith or you could do it? No, the locks helped. Okay, well, that's nice. That's nice. Good that you're yes, home. Thank you. Yes, thank you for excellent. your acting. <laughs> excellent, excellent, excellent. Ivan, what about you? What does the threat provoke on you? What's the effect threat got on your thought? Uh, I feel stressful, teacher. I, 
traffic jam in San Salvador, Pango, any any places in El Salvador. <laughs> okay, and what does it provoke on you? ¿Qué le provoca? And you get stressed. How do you notice uh, that you're stressed? ¿Cómo sabe de? ¿Cómo nota I, de que está I feel, uh, I feel, uh, I had a headache, for example. Okay, you get a headache. Yeah. That's a common uh, symptom. Um, uh, what else? Um, la cabeza. Um, Uh, only that. Just that. I mean, commonly what you get is the hiding. That's it. Okay. Thank you. Uh, what about you, uh, uh, Carlos Antonio? How do you notice when you're stressed? When I work too much. Okay, and through the how day. do you notice? ¿Cómo se da cuenta? How do you notice? ¿Cómo percibe? Because my when I feel my body when 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 I have a lot of pain on my body and I uh -huh. feel the stress. Mm -hmm. Okay, you got pain on your body. That's interesting. The stress thank you. me a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Xiomara, what about you? Hello, Xiomara. Yes, teacher. Tell me, how do you notice that you are under a lot of stress? ¿Cómo, cómo se da cuenta de todo? Que mucho el estrés que está soportando. When I lost my heart. When you what? Uh, when I se me cae el cabello, ¿cómo puedo decir? Oh, really? I lose my hair. Mm -hmm. And I, I have a problem with my stomach. Oh, so you got very specific symptoms. Yeah. Okay. What about you, Marlon? What are your symptoms when you, whenever you're stressed? For me, uh, the stress give, give me a headache, dolor de cabeza, headache, and lack of concent concentration. What oh. the concentration? Yeah, yeah. Mm, that's interesting. That's a common symptom that you are under too much stress. Yes. Okay. Luis Mario, what's your situation? Tell me. Yeah, teacher. In my case, um, the the stress affect me with with headache, uh -huh. and it's difficult to me to do things quickly when I am stress stressful. Under stressed or stressed. Under stress or stressed. Okay, okay. And the last uh, maybe. The stress make me very angry. Angry, no angry, angry, angry. 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 Yeah. No, no. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. For food. Oh, hungry. Hungry, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, makes me very hungry. Oh, yeah. You eat because you get anxious. Yeah. Yeah, that's dangerous. We get fat. <laughs> yeah. Okay, thank you. Well, guys, thank you very much, all of you. It was been a very interesting class. But it's time for me to get the attendance. Oh, Carla, God save she's like celebrating. We didn't do it tomorrow. Tomorrow. I'm sorry, guys. I know that there are some of you who wanted to participate, but uh, in the exercise, but the time is not enough. But the practice was very, very interesting. Let's see, guys, let me get the attendance. Just what is it all oh, right here?
Ok, Carlos Antonio Serrano Arias. Present teacher. Carlos Elivaldo Abrego Marmo. Present teacher. Ok, Edwin Alberto Rodríguez Lobo, Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Present teacher. Gustavo Pos Javier Ramírez Carranza. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molino. Present teacher. Ivan Petrovich Guzmán Aquino. Thank you. Palman Saúl Girón Sánchez. Josué Rodrigo Ortiz Monterrosa. Thank you. Here I am, teacher. Thank you. Juan Francisco Echala Montano. Present. Carla Lizeth García Lemos. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present. Luis Mario Creyo Guerrero. Present teacher. Magdaleno Escalante Orante. Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present teacher. Orlando Francisco Núñez. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Vilma Yesenia Alvarenga. Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present teacher, good night. Good night, Wilfredo. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Ivania Chamilet Domínguez Hernández. En Marlon Jonathan Gutierrez Girón. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Thank you very much, all of you, for being here. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Hello, teacher. Hello, mister. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. You told me last night that you're going to send me uh, how to, material support. I don't know how to, how to say it. In my, on oh, my, it's in my a material. Oh, OK. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Yeah, but I, I would like to have on, on the WhatsApp message. Okay, send me a message, please, so I can get you there. Okay, hold on a sec. Okay. Just one second. Everything is helping me a lot. That's great. Yeah. And I always get one of the question wrong. Only That's one. That's normal. That's normal. That's quite normal. I mean, remember, it, it is a process. It takes a little bit of time. There's a and... lot, but there's a lot of new words that I oh, haven't yeah. heard before. And that's cool because new vocabulary means more vocabulary for you. But I don't try to, I don't try to remember everything because it's difficult to process in my mind. Yeah. Yeah, and that's normal. I mean, as long as you get the main idea, that's what's important. Okay, just yeah, hold on that this is taking long to load up. I don't know why. What can you recommend me to get the
apps on my phone? What apps can I get from the app store in order to achieve my 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 goals to learn English? Apps. I'm study. Mm -hmm. I'm study by by Duolingo. It's a good app. BBC app. BBC app. Is yeah. for kids, uh, no? No. Let me see if I remember what it is. I'm not good at grammar. I'm just focused on listening and reading by now. I don't know why this thing is not connecting. Hold on, I'm trying to, try to connect from another browser. I don't know if it's my phone, my connection, or what. Have you went to the United States before? A couple of times. How was your experience over there? Ah, uh, it's cool. It's cool. Not for me. That way they spoke is so different. Man, I don't know why WhatsApp is not charging on my computer. I got it on but my you phone, can, but but you can sell me later if you want. Yeah, because I don't know why it's not logging in. You know. Mm -hmm. I know. Let's see. Supposedly it just did. Supuestamente ya me trajo, but oh yeah, now. Where did you go? In United States. Oh, different places. That's a long conversation. We will have it one day, but. I know, day, but, uh, I know you, are, long... you are in you are in a hurry. It's okay. I understand. No, 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 no. No, but it, it's true. It's a long conversation, for real. Uh, it will take us a lot of time. Okay. okay. From the second one you got here, you can get the, okay. the app. There's an app that you can BBC.co.uk from UK is yeah. the very difficult accent. Oh, yeah. It is, Actually, cool. I'm I'm watching Netflix series over there. There's a lot of UK accent, but it's good. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's excellent, and I mean the good thing is that you got the opportunity to practice more and to get acquainted with a different, uh, uh, different vocabulary, different accent, different situations, and different culture. So it's a good opportunity for you to practice. So I think yeah. more. Check them out and let me know how do they work for you, okay? Okay. I'll be in touch with you. Yeah, no problem. I'll be here, I'll be here. Okay, thank you for your help. Ah, oh, it's a pleasure. Good night. See you tomorrow. Oh, good night. See ya.
time. Let's see. Let's wrap it up in a few seconds. 